Hey everybody, my name is Dave Walsh and I am a high school science teacher and in this video I am going to outline very specific instructions on how you need to create your office hours for students. In order to do this you need to follow these directions pretty specifically so that's one of the reasons why we are um, recording them so that you can take the time to pause uh, the video to follow along if you need that. So you've created a class, you need to go into classwork. Office hours are going to be a, um, a time where students can digitally meet with you to ask questions about assignments that you've given them. In order to do this, you're going to create an assignment. For that assignment, you're going to give it a title. And that title I would suggest be office hours and then on whatever day these office hours are. You don't need to give any instructions. You don't need to add a link. You don't need to do anything over there. The important thing comes in over here on the right hand side in making sure that these um, values are correct. For this assignment, you want it to be ungraded. And then the most important thing is this. You want to make sure that the due date is set for the time, the day and time that you want your office hours to occur. So in this case, I'm setting up office hours for Monday and the time will be 10 a.m. Okay. And now I would create a topic that is office hours that is separate from all the other topics in your Google Classroom and then you can assign this. At this point the office hours process is not completed you still need to do one more thing. You need to go to Google Calendar you'll notice up on the top here there's a Google Calendar tab you're gonna open that. You're then going to find the day and the assignment in the Google Calendar. Okay, make sure you scroll up if you need to to find it and you'll see that my assignment is right here. You're going to click the assignment and you're going to edit it. You're going to edit and then you're going to turn on conferencing. Add conferencing, Hangouts Meet, and that's going to create a individual meeting code for your office hours. At that point, you are done and you can click save. And that now is there. Now, in order to get to your office hours, because you're going to have, you could have a couple of different office hours, depending on what your class load will be. You are going to now, you should be able to get to your classroom and your uh, classwork stream. You're going to again do everything from your Google Calendar. You're going to find the office hours that you have. You're going to then go to the assignment and then you can click join the meet. And that way you are one click for joining your Google Meet so that your students or the parents can have access to you to ask questions about the assignments so that you're still in contact with your students. This, these are the very specific instructions on how you should create office hours in case the school is, is closed for an extended period of time.